Hello and welcome everyone to the walk around video here at your next car, the 2019 69 Reg G20 330e M Sport. Vehicles presented in Porto Mile Blue features the YNZ body enhancement kit alongside some fantastic options and features. With all of our vehicles, it is physically in stock and is ready to be driven away. Let's get straight into talking about this vehicle. It is, as near makes no difference, a fully loaded fully equipped example of the e-drive 3 series so be sure to get through as much as possible including talking about some of the hybrid capabilities so it has got the option 19 inch m sport alloys they are in the original colorway they are an immaculate example of the bmw option 19 inch alloy they do also have the pirelli p0 tires we've added our front splitter matching Grills, side tail extensions, and YNT and performance decals. This car comes with the M rear spoiler and then our gloss black rear diffuser, which we'll show you in a moment. Beginning at the very front, we have got the visibility package, so that includes the laser headlamps. It has got the premium package, so you've got the electric slide and tilt sunroof. It has also got the M Plus package, so you've got your M brakes, you've got the rear privacy glass and the gloss black exhaust surrounds. Round at the back then, as I mentioned, you've got that colour-coded M rear spoiler, the gloss black exhaust surrounds and the same for the diffuser. The diffuser can still be upgraded, however, if you'd wish to, to one of our exa quad exhaust systems. Have a look through the advert photos and I'll all leave all of the relevant information there for you to take a look at. It has also got the comfort pack so you get a power operated tailgate and as you can see that'll open up to reveal a good sized boot and i've already laid it out on display the charging cable so this is super simple being that it is provided with a household three pin socket and again having that power operated tailgate is a really nice little touch nice touch as well in terms of charging it as we've just seen there, it is super simple because it comes with a three pin socket. But again, if we open up the car using the comfort access, as you can see, we just walk up to it and unlock it as easy as so. Providing we have the key on our person, we can then unlock the charging port and that is where you'll plug the car into. You can leave it to charge, leave it be. Think of it like you do with your mobile phone, leave it on overnight if you'd wish to throughout the day. It takes around about three to four hours to fully charge it if the batteries are empty. Now, of course, that charge time can be significantly reduced if you are to use either a fast charger or one that you are to have installed through the mains. Again, they do significantly reduce the charge time. Interior is the Oyster Venenskia leather. You've got the M seat belts. You have, of course, also got the customizable ambient lighting. So as you can see, when we open the front door, that'll come on there. Another option on this car is the technology package. So again, you've got Harman card and audio and we'll show you the other features in a moment. Lovely to have that glass sunroof, really opens up the interior, makes it feel nice and light, nice and open. And then also included in the premium package is the electric front seats. You do also get memory controls for the driver's side. Hence why I said right at the beginning, this is as nine as makes no difference, a fully loaded example of the G20 330e. If we have a seat inside then, yeah, again, more options to come. So you have got the option heated steering wheel. If we fire the vehicle up, you can see here the memory controls. We do also have a head up display. I'm not sure how well that's gonna come through, but you can just about make it out there. That lovely day outside, very, very bright, a little bit difficult to see until you get driving and it'll see it a little bit clearer, obviously. Touchscreen nav and media setup. So again, really, very simple to use and very effective. If we show you here, we've got Apple CarPlay and Android Auto, as well as regular Bluetooth functions. You've got DAB, music collection, Bluetooth, screen mirroring, USB lining. Tons to keep you entertained in terms of multimedia and connectivity. We've shown you the nav, let's check out the service status next of all, because of course it is a plug-in hybrid, so there is a petrol engine up front. We still have to service it, not for 12,000 miles however, and it has got full BMW service history. In terms of the range, 
BMW give a claimed range of around about 37 to 40 miles. Of course, once you've used that range up, it switches back over to that lovely petrol engine. Back over to show you some more spec then, you've got the wireless charging tray as part of the technology package. We do also have the Adaptive M suspension on this car, as you can see there, by the M Adaptive dampers. And if we close the sunroof up, just quickly show you the rear camera. And we'll step outside the car and show you how it looks with the sunroof closed. So there is a look around at this very, very well equipped example of the G20-330E M Sport. If you would like to know more, go ahead and use the links that are available in the description box. For the time being, thank you, take care, bye-bye.